just about to depart from King's Cross Station. Look the at that. steam, our transport correspondent Richard Westcott's been telling us how it smells there, a bit like the olden days. Built in 1923, it's now taking its first journey. It's going to go to York today, an official return to steam. And it's making its inaugural run between London and King's Cross and at York, and it's setting off. What a be fantastic now. sight. Just imagine you're a commuter at King's Cross Station this morning looking at that in front of you on one of the platforms. Saying earlier, it looks like something out of Harry Potter, doesn't it? The trip to, to Hogwarts out of King's Cross. But it is a beautiful sight, and it's what so many of those people who've worked so hard to, to restore the mo locomotive over the last few years have waited for this. Never have so many anoraks and notepads gathered on the platform and, there at King's Cross. I and non-anoraks. I think we're all really <laughs> excited about this. It's cost more than um, £2 million to restore this since 1963. It's had a long history of restoration, and actually. She's, she's had her paintwork done, hasn't she? Because she was black until quite recently, and they've repainted her Absolutely. in that beautiful green colour, which was the traditional colour of the locomotive. Look at that puffing. Can we have a listen to it as well? Because the sound's great, isn't it? There she is, chuffing away. Um, if you are a passenger on this train today, you would have paid around £450 for a ticket today for the privilege of riding, being on this train. Lots of people expected to be lined all along the route. As I said, it's from King's Cross to York.